Welcome to our problem solving question on fractions and ratio. So we've been told that odd numbers and even numbers are used in a game and the numbers are either red or blue and the ratio of a number of odds to the number of evens is 3 to 5 and the ratio of a number of odd red and odd blue is 4 to 5 and even red to even blue is 3 to 2. And we're going to work out the probability of choosing a red number. So I'm going to begin by writing each of these ratios as fractions. So we have odd to evens, which is 3 to 5, or as a fraction, 3 eighths to 5 eighths. And odd red to odd blue is 4 to 5, or 4 ninths to 5 ninths and even red to even blue is 3 to 2 or 3 fifths to 2 fifths. So now that I've written these as fractions I'm going to work out the probability of choosing a odd that is red and an even which is also red. So looking at the odds which are red, we know 3 eighths of them are odd and out of these 3 eighths, 4 ninths of them are red. So we're going to multiply 3 eighths by 4 ninths. And we can simplify this product using cross simplification where we divide by 3 and we can divide here by 4. So this product becomes 1 over 2 multiplied by 1 over 3, which is 1 6. So this is the probability of choosing an odd red. And the probability of an even red, well we know 5 eighths of them are even. And of these 5 eighths, we have 3 fifths, which are also red. And again, we can simplify this product by dividing here and here by 5. So now we have 1 eighth multiplied by 3 over 1, which is 3 eighths. And finally, the probability of choosing a red number would be the odd red, 1 6, or the even red, which is 3 eighths. And to add these together, we need a common denominator, which I'm going to use as 24. I'll multiply this fraction by 4. So it's 4 over 24. And this fraction by 3. So that is 9 over 24. So the probability of choosing a red number is 13 out of 24. Okay. Thank you for watching and I hope you found that useful. Thanks again and take care.